All right, so pup has made a boyfriend. This is Chewy. <laughs> this is Janie's pup. Chewy, look che at the camera. He says, hi, I am 14 and healthy. And now they're debating who's going to get the bed. Pup seems to like it. What you doing? Aww. <laughs> They've been playing all morning. She's like, it's a nice bed. He's a happy boy. What a healthy boy, Jane. You're doing great. We are with Janie right now. We absolutely love her. She dedicates a lot of her time for free as a volunteer helping the Florida Trail Association and this area. And we really, really appreciate you. And I've seen hands on how much you do. So thank you so much. It's been a pleasure. One. Great meeting you. And pups. <laughs> Please come and volunteer and help us on the Florida Trail to maintain it. Thank you. So we're dealing with a lot of uh, down trees from the storm, of course, and this is always a challenge in through hiker's life. Good morning, pup. How you doing? Here we go. Come on. I'm going this way. We're going to try to go around. And this is the fourth time this morning I've had to go around. No big deal. Just that's hiker's life. Come on there, flower child, sniffing everything. Oh yeah, it's the mornings. Come on. It's not fun. You want me to carry you? Hmm? You want help? I'm tired today? Here, come here. Pop. <laughs> she always takes the easy route. <laughs> She's the smart one. There you go. Alright, we're going to go over here. Yeah, looks like we got an easy way in, Pop. Right over here. Yeah. Okay, come on, baby girl. See this way right here? Let's go this way. There you go. There you go. You got thorns. And... There you go, girl. Vines. And... That wasn't too bad. That was the easiest walk around we've had yet. Okay. Good morning. Well, it's a little chilly here. Saturday, February the 8th. Five after nine. And had a late start to trail, which was fine. Wanted to chit chat and give feedback to Janie, the volunteer, because she has a lot of connections in the Florida Trail Association. And uh, we had a great discussion and talked about some of the down trees from the storm that just came through. A lot of feedback in there, and it's very nice of her. She put us up for a second night so we could discuss all these matters. And there wasn't really much for tenting in the area that uh, we were in, so it worked out really good. Hate to impose on her. And, but she said it was no problem so it gave us a chance to discuss everything and plus pup and uh, chewy they hit it off pretty good together and we wanted to give them a play date and give pup a little break from trail so that was great and uh, we're back on the trail this morning and we're probably going to have two light days because up ahead is a town um i think it's lake butler and we've been uh, very interested in stopping there we could get there tonight we can get there tomorrow night. It's only 19 miles, so we're debating on doing two short days or a big day or whatever. We'll figure it out. Of course, you know, Pup and I do heavy discussions, so yeah, we just figure it out as we go. We wing it, but we're just going to enjoy this day. It's starting off blue. It's a little chilly. Got the little strapless blueberry earmuffs on, having a good day. And 
pups in good spirits, doing her thing. Yeah, we're just chilling down and enjoy this day. Can't go wrong with McDonald's sausage, egg, no cheese, English muffins with mayonnaise. Yum. So we're gonna tell them. So a part of this trail we're on right now this walk that we're on it's a beautiful walk but these large stones right here they're ankle breakers and they're rough on pups paws and we've slowed right down you know you step on them and unless you got really really thick hardy stiff boots you're gonna feel every stone and some of them can make you really jolt to the left and twist your ankle so be aware in this area you know and you just gotta be cautious and slow down just part of the trail we're not going to complain too much, are we, kiddo? It's a nice day. Orange Blaze is right on the railroad tracks. How cool is that? Another one's right down there. Come on there. Big stones. Huh. You know, this, this is granite. I don't think you can get granite anywhere in Florida. I wonder how long that was transported. Maybe people in the comments can let us know in the research on where the granite come from. That'd be kind of cool to find out. We're going to continue on trail and look forward to anybody that can get that information and throw it in there. Thank you in advance. The story of the new toy. Oh, I don't know. Uh, I mean, sometimes on roads it's nice to have something to entertain yourself with. And yeah. I just... A golf ball is really great, or a tennis ball, or something like that. But I found a little ball bearing, so that's awesome. And now I'm going to pick on you because you are a professional lightweighter. You are, yeah, you here are good. I am carrying here. a stainless steel. <laughs> this little thing probably weighs one pound. But I'll throw it away once I get tired of it. So. That's good though. That's a good toy, brother. <laughs> so uh, your name is Jupiter, Jupiter, and you're doing a full southbound hike. Yeah, this and is actually my second time. Rock on. Yeah. Have you recorded with the Florida Trail Association your first and your second hike? No. Please do that. <laughs> um, they know of me. Uh, would you recommend doing the Florida Trail to others? Yeah, absolutely. Right on. Absolutely. I think it's a fantastic trail. I'd, 
I love every single year I love seeing a little bit more of the trail get off of the roads and into the woods and I think the sections that are within the woods which you know is the vast majority of them are really a plus right on what do you enjoy most about doing the Florida Trail um, I like that it's at a season where you couldn't really go hike anything else unless you're gonna go to like South America or Africa or you know there's just not a lot you can do now without leaving the country so that's really cool and then you know you can use this to kind of lead into another hike and have a really nice fitness level already built up from the Florida Trail mm -hmm. you know we're not hiking on mountains or anything we're hiking through a little bit of swamp so you can kind of relax and just build that fitness at your level and mm -hmm. Yeah. What do you think about footwear for a lot? There's a lot of footwear issues, especially doing northbound coming out of Cyprus. What would you recommend as like kind of like a happy medium footwear or what are you using? You don't have to recommend anything. What do you do to survive like blisters and the swamps and everything else? I think it's really uh, just taking care of yourself and oh. some cows. Yeah. <laughs> cows running. But I think it's just paying attention to yourself. I see a lot of people that will start off with someone else or start off in a group. And that group or that other person may not be right for them, you know. So it's really important to, you know, just pay attention to how you are feeling. If you feel anything different or weird or, you know, you got to address it. So, you know, I wear like really minimal shoes. Yep. You wear something closer to a boot. Yep. But it's... For every single person, it's different what you're gonna enjoy. So, do you wear these full time, including in the swamp? Yeah. You do. What are they? Uh, these are just New Balance. I don't know. New Balance They're just TVs? Very minimal. Excellent. Yeah. yeah very Excellent. Minimal, yeah. Very cheap. I actually wore a water shoe going through a uh, cheap uh, Amazon water shoe going through uh, Cypress. So, cool. about the same. I really appreciate you sharing everything, Brighter. Yeah. Thank you, you hike very your hike. Much. We're still on the rail part of the trail, 12.30 in the afternoon, and the stones are more embedded in the ground. Looks like a lot of traffic comes through here, and vehicles. Uh, we're enjoying it. I mean, we have uh, been spoiled with two nights at Janie's, bless her, and uh, we're just out enjoying it. Pups of great spirits right behind, and... We're just kind of chilling down, enjoying this nice, peaceful walk today. It is beautiful out.
And there's the first dog we had to spray so far on the hike. Yep, comes again, we'll spray him again. Too bad. Depends how you look at things. Okay, pup, we're back on trail. Here we go. Yeah, let's take five. Yeah, over here. Come on. A nice spot right here. Right here. <laughs> 